What is up guys? So it is 11 at night. Just got done with work. Gonna go do a little bit of cardio right now. But it is cold as shit right now. So we're gonna go do some laps at the grocery store at 11 at night. Because that's what we do. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Let you know how it goes. I'm gonna probably do about an hour. Let's get it. All right, everyone. It is a bright new day. Going to be getting up, getting ready to go to the gym. And I just want to explain a little bit kind of the things you have to do and the things I've done in order to achieve my goals. Now, obviously, doing cardio at the grocery store is completely ridiculous. It is, without a doubt, you know, one of the craziest things that I have to do. And, you know, you just look silly just wandering around the grocery store for an hour. But that's what it takes. That's the things you have to do when things don't go according to plan, when things, you know, maybe don't go as you want. And I think this past year really showed that when things start falling apart, when things are going against the norm, what you are going to do, how you're going to react to it, and what you are going to do to make your goals happen, not just when things are going good, when things are going bad, when things, you know, really start falling apart. I remember when the gym shut down, you know, I was I was making dumbbells out of cat litter buckets. I was using a wheelbarrow for a bench press. I mean, just completely ridiculous, but it works. And those are the things you have to do if you really want something truly bad enough. It doesn't matter how much you want it what matters is what are you going to do and how bad do you want to do the things that are going to make it happen and make you achieve your goals now really i could go one day without you know getting a walk in because i, I bar 10 so i'm on my feet all day it, the calories to me don't really matter it's about setting the discipline it's about setting the mindset that no matter what this is something I do whether I feel like it or not you can take an hour out of your day and go for a walk at the end of every night I do it every single night doesn't matter how I get it done it gets done and those are the kind of things you need to do especially when you're going for these extreme fitness goals that I have you got to make things work any means necessary and it goes to show a lot of people this past year have used, you know, the virus that's in the pandemic that's going around as a way to justify, you know, I can't do this. Uh, the gyms are closed. Um, I can't go to the grocery store, get healthy food. You know, it's it was looking for an out the whole time. You know, if you really want to do something, you really want something to make happen, you're going to find a way. And if not, you'll find an excuse. And to me, I do these things to make it happen. And I do these things because I'm not looking for an excuse. I'm looking for results. And I want to achieve these goals. And I do this every day. You can't take any days off when it comes, you know, getting shredded out of your mind, making these drastic transformations. And you're going to have to do with things that are a little extreme to some people, but that's what it takes. That's how you get things done is finding a way, not just when it's going well. Like I said, when you're faced with adversity, what can you do in order to make it happen? Um, so I'm going to wake up a little bit, get ready to go to the gym. just want to share my thoughts with you guys. I hope you have a good one.